Earlier this month, we talked about four prominent bankers and financial executives found dead of apparent suicides within a span of just a few days. We talked about the kind of suspicious nature of it. There was former Federal Reserve economist Mike Duker, 58 year old former senior executive of Deutsche Bank, William Brecksmith, Tata Motors managing director Carl Slim who was found in a hotel in Bangkok and Gabriel McGee, the 39 year old vice president of JP Morgan Chase and Company's London headquarters. Very strange. We now have yet another name to add to this list. This is another employee of JP Morgan Chase who has been found weeks after another one of his employees of his colleagues fell from the bank's London headquarters. This is Ryan Crane, who was 37 years old worked at the bank's New York office for 14 years as the executive director of a stock trading team. And he died in his Stamford, Connecticut home. We still don't have a cause of death. Toxicology will be probably about another four weeks to ultimately reveal the cause of his death. He started at JP Morgan trading equities after graduating from Harvard University in 1999. What is going on? Some are suggesting that this may be actual suicide because these bankers know of something that is going to cause a huge banking collapse that will ruin the lives of many, many bankers. And they're choosing to take their lives ahead of time. Another train of thought, assuming that it's not simply a coincidence and with every new death, it seems less likely, I guess we could say, statistically speaking. Um, the other idea is that these are not actual suicides, that these guys are being taken out for some reason. The story is getting stranger and stranger. It really is. But thinking that this is uh, about some type of upcoming catastrophe, it makes me think of uh, that movie Margin Call and that, you know, maybe there is something going on here that, that we don't know about. Uh, it's, it's not nice to think about, but we're also talking about people working for international companies, not, you know, not strictly in the United States. So uh, I don't know if it's something that could would affect the whole world, but it is very strange. Send me your thoughts as to what you think is going on. And if you think nothing is going on, that this is just a coincidence, send me that as well, because I'm curious if if most of our audience thinks there's nothing to see here, I would want to know that that would be relevant to me.